Hey, my name is Dux, and today I'm gonna show you how to fix crashes in Fortnite. So what you do is go to the top right corner, find the gear icon, and on display you should see rendering mode. Make sure it says performance mode. Most of you are watching this after an update, so probably Fortnite has something unoptimized in their game, and it's making you crash more. So make sure to have performance mode on. Okay, now you can go to Epic Games and you want to find Fortnite. If for some reason it doesn't even let you get into the game, what I want you to do is go to manage and verify your game. It actually helps you a lot. While we're still on Epic Games, what you could do is click the three dots right here and press on options and you could pre-download streamed assets. I know it helps with crashing, so you could do it. Okay, now click on the three dots right here, go on manage and find installations and there's this folder icon which says open install location. So just press on it. Now you want to press on Fortnite game, binaries win64 and now you want to scroll a little bit down until you see Fortnite client win64 shipping.exe and right click on it. Now go to properties, go to compatibility and make sure this is ticked and this says Windows 8 and also disable full screen optimizations. Trust me, this helps a lot and usually that is the issue. Okay, don't leave this folder yet. What you wanna do is go to the top, find easy anti-cheats and just press on it. Find easy anti-cheat setup.exe. Now go to send to and put on desktop. Now you want to just drag it from your desktop to this folder right here. Now go to the shortcut folder, right click it, press properties and on the very end, write repair and press apply. Now all you want to do is just double click it and it's going to run a few scripts and that's it. Okay, now write control R, write local app data percent like this and press OK. Now you want to find Fortnite game and double press it, go to saved. And what you want to do is just delete everything. This will delete all of your settings. This will delete all of your settings, but it usually fixes the issue. So when you go back to Fortnite, you might want to change your settings. After you did all of the steps, what I want you to do is reboot your PC. And if this helped you, please make sure to use code not Stelux in the item shop. It really helps me a lot. So thank you for everyone who has been using it. I'm gonna see you in the next video. Bye bye.